Hello and welcome back to JMeter session. This session is a part two of the SMTP sampler session that was uh, conducted earlier. So I'm going to repeat few things from the SMTP sampler session. Earlier we had run the SMTP sampler with just one thread, with one ramp up period and one loop count. Now I will increase the number of threads to five, which I have already done over here, and let's see how it works out. So I have these are the things that were already added. In addition to that, I have added a mail reader sampler. I have disabled it for now. Let's send the emails first and see whether it is working for multiple threads. So I put it over here. I clear the earlier results, and now I run it. The mail reader sampler is already in place in the lib folder of JMeter. So uh, the results have started coming. and five emails have been triggered let's see whether we have received the emails or not this is the yahoo account and i just refresh it okay there uh, there was some delay so uh, the emails have come 1 2 3 4 and 5 five threads and the current time stamp and uh, if you notice the thread number has started coming over here the problem with the thread num was uh, there was a additional underscore that was typed in my mistake and i re, uh, i removed that uh, additional underscore and now it is showing the exact thread number after the uh, welcome message in the subject in the body it is showing the current time stamp as expected so these are the five emails that were sent out using the smtp sampler now what we are going to do is we are going to disable this smtp sampler and we are going to enable this mail reader sampler mail reader sampler uses the same java uh, mail file that was put into the lib folder in the earlier session so i will explain you what the mail reader sampler is all about there is a name there are comments then the protocol in our case since we are reading from a yahoo server it's imaps you will find the uh, details of yahoo server over here imap server settings for yahoo the incoming mail we are going to see and for that our server is imap.mail.yahoo.com the port is 993 and ssl so uh, we have already set everything here the protocol is imaps server host is imap.mail.yahoo.com server port is 993 username and password are my username and password and the folder from which we will be extracting the emails is inbox number of messages we can select as all or we can specify a number if we select all then the entire inbox will be loaded into jmeter and jmeter will be uh, it will be a problem for jmeter it might crash because of the heavy load so i have just retrieved two messages to start with if we select this fetch headers only then it will only fetch the header headers in those messages this uh, delete messages from the server is very important when you are debugging your tests so if you are sending a test message to the server then uh, to the email server then uh once the message is done we can delete that message and it can help in our reducing the number of messages sent to the server store message using uh, mime this is not required as of now security settings are uh, we are currently using the use ssl for gmail we, we will use use start tls and the others are not required as of now so uh, the, these this is the mail reader sampler screen and these are the entries that are to be filled in so uh, now let's uh, run this using the view results tree i will clear the results and run it oh uh, before that we need to change the threads to one again since we are only doing it for one thread so now let's get back to view results tree and we will run it and see what we get so it is running 
and it will get over in a couple of minutes now it has completed so we get the mail reader sampler as passed and there are two messages that are retrieved this is the uh, first message and this is the entire response data uh, this is the very first message uh, in uh, order to retrieve the latest message there is no facility as of now this will retrieve the very first message the very first message in your inbox and this is the message too so this is something related to some career fair or something so that that's not of uh, importance here but the important thing is we have retrieved both the messages successfully and just remember that these are the oldest messages not the latest messages that's the only difference that needs to be taken care of in case you are debugging or you are using it for your test uh, smtp server then you will not have many messages in your smtp uh, mailbox so it will be simple for you but in my case there are plenty of messages and i had to uh, go back to the older messages in order to see whether my data is correct or not so uh, this is all about the smtp sampler and the mail reader sampler and i have executed it for more than one threads for the smtp sampler and i have shown you how to retrieve messages using mail reader sampler in case you have questions on either the smtp sampler or mail reader sampler do post a message or do comment and if you like my video please like uh, please hit like button and do subscribe to my channel thank you